Good day, grade 6. Good day, mga ka-maestro matuto. Welcome to my YouTube channel, Maestro Matuto. But before I proceed, don't forget to like and hit the bell icon for more mathematics video. Please subscribe. Mathematics 6 Quarter 4 Week 1 Determining the relationship of volume between a rectangular prism and a pyramid, a cylinder, and a cone, a cylinder, and a spear. What's in? In the previous lessons, you have learned how to find the surface area of cubes, prisms, pyramids, cylinders, cones, and spears. This time, we will focus on how to determine the relationship of volume between rectangular prism and a pyramid, a cylinder and a cone, a cylinder and a spear. Fill in the blanks. The volume of blank is one-third of the volume of a rectangular prism with the base and height. What do you think is the answer? Correct! Pyramid In finding the volume of a soccer ball, the formula to use is what? Very good! 4 third pi radius to the third power. Cone exactly fills one third of a blank whose base and height are equal. Great cylinder. The volume of a cylinder is the product of the circular base area and the blank height. Correct. Having the same radius and height, the volume of a blank is two-thirds of the volume of a cylinder. Yeah, spear. Relationship of the volume between rectangular prism and pyramid. Exploring volume of a rectangular prism. Study the figure. The rectangular prism has its height. The weight, the width, and the length. To get the volume of the rectangular prism is length times width times height. So it has 2 cm height, 5 cm length, and 3 cm width. The volume is 5 cm length times 3 cm width and 2 cm height. So 5 times 3 is 15 times 2 is 30 cm cube or 30 cubic cm. Considering the following, Pyramid and the rectangular prism having equal bases with equal areas. In the rectangular prism, imagine the rectangular prism or the pyramid is inside the rectangular prism. The height is 6 cm, the length is 6 cm, and the width is 4 cm. First, get the volume of the rectangular prism. So, the formula is length times width times height. The length is 9 cm, width with 4 cm, and the height with 6 cm. So, the answer is 216 cubic cm. Now, let's proceed to the pyramid. The pyramid has two formula, whether one-third base times height 
or one third len times width times the height. In the pyramid, we have one third times len times width times height. So volume is equals to one third times nine centimeter length with four centimeter and six centimeter height. So where we're going to multiply nine times four times six is two hundred sixteen cubic centimeter divided by three. The answer is seventy two cubic centimeter. Thus, the volume of a pyramid, which is 72 cubic centimeter, is one third of the volume of the rectangular prism, which is 216 cubic centimeter. Now, let us proceed to the relationship between the volume of the cylinder and cone. Exploring the volume of a cylinder. Cylinders are circular bases. Finding the volume of a cylinder is just like finding the volume of a prism. The volume is equals to phi radius to the second power times the height. Or the area of the base times the height. Or volume is pi times radius to the second power times the height. In example, Step number one, find the volume of cylinder with a radius of 2 cm and a height of 15 cm. Use 3.14 for the phi. So the solution is volume is equal to phi times radius to the second power times the height. And 3.14, so times 2 itself. 50 times 15 centimeters. So 2 times 2 is 4 centimeters squared times 15 times 3.14. So the total is 188.4 cubic centimeter. In step number 2, exploring the volume of a cone. If a cone is filled with the water or sand and then its content is poured into a cylinder, with equal base area and height, only a third of the cylinder will be filled. The figure is like this. So, to get the volume is equals to one-third pi times radius times the height. R the radius will be multiplied by itself or volume is equals to one-third base times the height. In this example, step number two, let's find the volume of the given cone whose height measures is 15 cm and the radius measures 2 cm. Solution, phi r to the second power times the height. So volume is equal to 3.14. So for 2 times 2 is 4 squared times 15 cm. So, we're going to divide by 3. The answer is 188.4 cm cube divided by 3. The volume of the code is 62.8 cubic centimeter. The relationship between the volume of the cylinder and sphere. Exploring the volume of a spear. Peel a cylinder with water. Push a spear with the same radius into the cylinder. The volume of the cylinder would be the area of its base times the height, which is the pi radius to the second power times 2 radius or 2 pi times radius cube. The spear does not fill up the cylinder, so this will be 2 third times 2 times pi times radius cube. Notice the 2 third of the water will be displaced, so the volume of the spear 
is two-third of the volume of the cylinder. For the solution, is volume is equals to phi radius to the second power times t high. So, we have the phi 3.14 and 3 cm squared times 6 cm. 3 times 3 is 9 cm squared times 6 times 3.14. The answer is 169 and 56 cubic centimeter. Volume is uh, is equals to four third times pi radius cubic. So this is for the sphere. So the volume is equals to four third times three point fourteen times three centimeter cube. So three times three is twenty. Uh, three times three times three is twenty seven cubic centimeter. So, 27 cubic centimeter times 3.14, the answer is 339 and 2012 cubic centimeter divided by 3, the answer is 113 and 4 cubic centimeter. Notice that the volume of the sphere is 113 cubic centimeter is two-thirds of the volume of the cylinder 169 and 56 cubic centimeter this confirms that the volume of the sphere is two-thirds of the volume of a cylinder with the same radius math challenge have you ever filled water tank container with six feet high Marcus filled a water tank shaped like a cylinder. It is 6 feet tall and has a radius of 4 feet. How many cubic of water can the tank hold? This is Maestro Matu to live Shatsu. Keep on study and your life will be happy. See you next week guys. Don't forget to share.